It's nearly Christmas. What happened? It was March yesterday. I don't know what's going on. Help. I want to talk to you today about blagging stuff, getting things for free, and getting things for a lot cheaper than you would normally. I've mastered the art of this somehow. It's all, sorry, I'm, I jingle. What I've learned recently, uh, we've been running hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of events going on and they are absolutely manic. And every time, we don't really want to spend all the money that we need to spend. So that involves bartering with people, getting things for cheaper, or getting things for free. What can we borrow? What can we barter for? What can we get for free without having to spend any more money than we absolutely have to? So my first example, chairs. Every single event that we go on, we need chairs and we need tables. We usually come up to empty shopping units with nothing in them, so we need chairs and tables. The first thing I do is I find a list of all of the independent providers of event hire. So put it this way, if you walk into Beaverbrooks, the jewellers, and you want to try and get your jewellery in their shop, how hard is that going to be? Not impossible, granted. It's going to be a little bit trickier. Because they're a bigger company, they're going to have process and they're going to have things that they need to do in order to get your stuff in their shop. If you go to the independent one around the corner that's not quite on the high street, it's going to be a little bit easier to get your stuff in there because they haven't got this procedure. When they haven't got that procedure, they're so much easier to work with because they really do want to help you because they want to make more business happen for them. They want to make more stuff happen. Working with independent people is a really key one in what I do to make stuff happen and get stuff cheaper. Other stuff, getting stuff for free. It's not always the easiest, but when you've got things that you can really leverage, when you've got really good skills and things that you can offer people in exchange for what they have that you need, you can go a really long way, really long way. The process that I go through for this is I make a phone call. Don't start with an email, it's not direct enough. Start with a phone call. Make friends, tell them what you're trying to do and how they can help and see what you can offer. Going through that process opens the door to them in ideas of, I could get my brand in front of more people. People want to help, especially those independent companies. The last bit on top of that is just be easy to work with. Be nice to work with, be energetic, exchange your passion to them, excite them about what's going on because they're much more likely to do it regularly and do it more often and do it better for you. The event hire companies we work with in Reading, the ones we've worked with in Croydon, I've made brilliant relationships with these people and that means that I can go back to them the next time. They offer me a similar discount, if not better, and you just stay in touch with them. I recommend them to people. I do good things for them. I repay the favour. By doing that, it carries these relationships on a little bit longer. That's my process for getting free stuff. The main thing there is making friends. Because when you make friends with people, that's when stuff really starts to happen because people really, really want to help you out. Thanks for watching. If I don't see you before, if I see you, I mean through that thing. Have a brilliant Christmas. Tell everybody that you love them because hopefully you do. If you don't, you're an evil person. Subscribe to our videos. We are reducing the amount of videos we're going to be doing to three a week as opposed to one a day. That gives us a little bit more time. We can give you actually better valued content rather than just last minute stuff that doesn't quite make sense all the time. Have a good Christmas. Have a brilliant new year if I don't see you before. See you soon.